I'm in El Cajon today. This East County city has a large Chaldean community and is home to one of the largest populations of Iraqi war refugees in the country, around 50,000. Earlier today, I was at an event where Supervisor Joel Anderson presented the Chaldean Community Council with $500,000 for its business incubator. I talked to the founder about what it means. The first time I talked about this project was 2015. I approached the city with the idea of the incubator and how important it is to have an incubator, but it took like nine years <laughs> to get the starting point, and thank God you can see the... Uh, so this was definitely a, a partnership between the county and, and the, the city, city and you guys. Yes. Um, I, I guess talk to us just a little bit about what, what that's like to know that you have the city and the county behind you. Yeah, it is, it's amazing because this project we need partnership and uh, funding and uh, so we are blessed that the city council this uh, approve uh, that they give us this building like they mentioned for one dollar a year which is a big you know, success now you can see Mark said they're gonna give us exemption on the property tax which is also amazing and so the county is doing uh, the uh, everybody's doing their part to help with this project but this is just uh, like 500,000 maybe is gonna take us for you know a little bit but we need we need more help actually where exactly will this money go how will this money so be basically uh, an incubator need uh, take care of the candidate like uh, when they come we give them office space okay. we give them equipment we give them mentorship training uh, branding marketing all of that needs money yeah uh, plus we have a staff we have to have somebody to run the incubator and uh, manage these people and uh, help them with their project to learn more about the chaldean community council and its programs you can go to our website 10news.com